Hello, my name's Matt Morris, and I'm in the process of designing a mobile phone app that will revolutionize community involvement by allowing citizens to be constantly updated as to what their community leaders and organizations are doing or planning to do and what they might expect from their constituents. The app will promote government transparency and civic interaction by providing citizens a response channel for questions and suggestions. The problem is brain drain. Many communities across southeastern Ohio have lost major employers over the past generation. And when the children graduate high school, they leave the community to go to college or find employment and never return. This is already on top of an inferiority complex that many citizens have with their public officials. J.W. states, my opinion will never matter because my name isn't Calhoun or Thurman. Civic Channel will allow JW a voice. Civic Channel addresses the issues and doesn't ignore the concerns. J Pope works two hours away, and by the time he gets home to his community, he's drained. Civic Channel will allow J to know what's going on instantly, and if there is a civic meeting that night that J would need to attend, Civic Channel would let him know and he could plan accordingly. Civic Channel will give citizens access to information, link them to public officials and agencies, and allow them to see event listings and coupons. Public officials will have the opportunity to schmooze the public and explain their actions or clear their names. Local businesses get another avenue for advertising and more opportunity for self-promotion like coupons. Nonprofits will get much needed exposure and promote community events. Revenues will be reinvested and used as incentives toward all participating parties. Civic Channel will be given free to all the citizens and the public agencies will pay a small fee. And that fee might be waived the more they use the product. The more usage, the lower the rates. And that would go toward the nonprofits, the local businesses, politicians, and the agencies. The more they use it, the lower the rates. That's the incentives for these guys to use Civic Channel. Each community will be responsible for maintaining their own page, like Facebook. Each public communications officer will be establishing their community profile and information gathering protocols. The best techniques will be disseminated to all the communities to make the information gathering more efficient. The competition that we see is Nextdoor is a social media app that allows neighbors to communicate with each other. EventBridge is a corporation that works with companies and governments to provide emergency alert services. Many communities use Facebook or Twitter for public interaction, but each agency has their own independent page. Civic Channel will conglomerate all of the community agencies and report from one site. Civic Channel will investigate, gather, verify, and disseminate the information and allow a channel for public response. This slide here is our business model canvas. It offers a more detailed look at how the company will work. On it, you'll see the key partners that we will have, key activities, key resources, value propositions, what we will have to offer, customer segments, who we will offer that to, customer relationships, and then channels that we will use to offer. And then at the bottom, we have the cost structure and revenue streams. Once again, I'm Matt Morris, and I'm with Civic Channel, an app that allows community leaders to report more efficiently and allows community members to respond. The hope in creating the app is that it will provide an easy platform that community leaders will adopt to promote their community and community-minded residents will adopt to stay informed and invite others to follow. This concludes the presentation. Thank you for your time. If you have any questions, feel free to ask.